Hey guys, today we are in Volkswagen with MIB unit and I'm going to show you how to check the VCRN. This is an, uh, like a, an ID number of the main unit of the infotainment uh, system in this vehicle. So over here we have the display, but this is just the display. It's a display, some buttons, two knobs, a touch surface and uh, this uh, sensor over here. But the main unit is actually over here. Here it is. It looks like a CD changer or card reader, but in fact, this is the main unit. So there's a CPU inside, there's a memory, uh, there's an internal amplifier, GPS receiver, and so on. And if you want to check the VCRN, well, there are two ways. I thought that there are three ways. So I took those radio removal tools and I've removed the main unit from the glove box, um, hoping, uh, hoping that the uh, number that we are looking for will be on the sticker on the unit itself, but it's not. So let me show you how to do this the other way. Over here, let's press and hold the menu button for about three seconds and it will take you to the service mode and in service mode, go to function and en enabling codes, installed codes, select one of the valid codes like this one and you will have the VCRN number over here. 10 digits long. Sometimes it's it's split so we have five sections of two. You would have EF, 1F, C6, C5, A6. Yeah, five sections with two digits each. Um, so this is one of the ways but if you don't have the developer mode enabled in your unit as I do over here, you might not have this option in the service menu. The function enabling codes option might be not visible for you. So I will show you how um, to get this number, the same number with a diagnostic tool like OBD11. So let me leave this on, on the display. And over here I have, uh, I have OBD11, which is already connected with the vehicle. OBD11 application over here, OBD11 dongle over there in the diagnostic port, and we are going to press the bottom right button which takes us to the list of all modules scroll down to module 5f which is the infotainment unit the multimedia as it's called over here and over here we are going to live data we have a huge list of all the things that we can check from the device sensors and status of uh, different uh, parts of the firmware and hardware and we are, uh, we are actually going to use the search bar over here and input in the visualization characteristics. So let's select it, let's press done. And right now you can see that we have live data from the unit with the number that we are looking for. And you can check, you can check that this is this is the same number. So this is how to get it with a diagnostic tool like OBD11. You can of course use different things like VCDS, or some uh, scan tool like I have over here, over here. As, so, uh, as long as it can read live data from um, Volkswagen Audi, Seat and Skoda uh, modules. And in some cases, uh, if you are short, one number or two numbers short, uh, most likely there's a zero somewhere over here missing at the beginning. Uh, and so that will be the case, just a tip if you have a, um, a VCRN number which is not 10 digits long if it's shorter. Okay, so that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Check out my previous videos and subscribe for the future ones. See you soon.